hello hi hi hello um what's going on so oh so you just gonna come out the okay so you just wasn't gonna stop at all okay cool i understand um <clears throat> so what's today today is the 30th i am recording some pre-trip footage so i can have something to post for y'all for vlogmas while i'm in jamaica by this time, y'all have seen all my good lineups, my house transformation, my try on haul, my black business review, all that, all that. Um, I'm tired of shit. Like, like I'm so sleepy. <laughs> I don't know what that was. I'm so sleepy. Like, I'm, I'm real, like, real, real sleep. Would you bring your ass? Damn, I hate the hood. This nigga's all in the back. What time is it? I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just, I'm just not it today. Like, I need my sunglasses. I can't find them. I need to wear these other ones that the prescription just don't work no more. But shit, if my other ones don't come in time for Jamaica, I'm gonna have to practice wearing these anyway. I lost my sunglasses. I'm so mad. No, I don't like these. They're not dark enough. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I left them in that rental. I'm almost positive I did. Yeah, no. I need that down. Anyway, um, I'm recording some pre-trip footage. Uh, today is Tuesday the 30th. And I leave on Friday the 3rd at 6 in the morning. Would y'all fucking go? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, I cuss in case y'all didn't know. It's even worse when I'm in the car. So if you see me in the car vlogging, you already know. It's, it's about to be some road rage happening. It's, it's happening. It ain't nothing nobody can do to stop it. Um, but I definitely woke up too late today. I was supposed to get my COVID test. First of all, shit's frustrating as hell. Like, I, I'm grateful for my trip. I love that I'm going on my trip. That's Houston Mobility Response. I definitely don't want to pull up next to you. <laughs> I'm not. And not. Um, it's frustrating. It's frustrating. You gotta have a COVID test on a certain day from a certain place of a certain kind, and you gotta you gotta get the rapid. Then, if you like me and you ain't got no damn insurance, then you might have to pay some money, and the money you might have to pay is a little pricey. So it it be a lot. Hmm? It be a lot. I was definitely a little stressed for a second. So I finally booked my COVID test appointment for today at twelve, and. Uh, I overslept. I woke up at 2. It's 3.53, so that means I woke up approximately two hours ago. I don't know how I missed every alarm I set. Now, granted, okay, I sleep hard as shit, right? Like, I sleep hard, like super hard. But normally, because I my sleep pattern is all messed up, I go to sleep at like 4 or 5 in the morning, then I'll wake up at like 1 or 2. I'm trying to fix it. I'm, I'm trying to, but my body is being stubborn as hell. Like, I'm not sleepy until 2 o'clock. So, it's it's going to take some time, but I'm going to do it. I, I'm going to do it. And then because I wake up so late, I miss a lot of the daytime to get work done, which means now I have to smush in and do all my work in the middle of the night. So, I met mean, girl, look at that glow. Come on, new phone, who this? Um... Y'all will see the director's view version of the vlogs coming soon when I get to Jamaica and actually got some shit to show y'all. Because otherwise, y'all just be looking at me on 90 right now. Um, But I sleep hard as shit. Like, it don't make no sense. Like, Christian, Christian told me I got to go to the doctor because I sleep too hard. But it's really that bad. Like, I, I can sleep through anything. I don't need, I can't, I can't hear no sounds. The only, the best way for me to wake up is a human. A human has to wake me up. And by human, I don't mean some random motherfucker. Because as hard as I do sleep, if a motherfucker sneak up on me in my sleep, I will pop the fuck up. If I don't feel, if I don't, because I know energy. So like Christian can, can sneak up on me while I'm asleep. Or Rodney can sneak up on me while I'm asleep. They could be right in front of me. But because I know their energy and know that they're not a threat, I won't get up. Like, I know that they're there, but it won't make me, like, jump up and want to fight. Versus anybody else, I'm going to jump up 
if I'm not used to your energy being around me while I'm sleeping. That comes from being abused as a child in my sleep. So I have that, like, you know, people who have been in jail are like that. Like, they, you can't walk up on a motherfucker that did some time. <coughs> I was trying to laugh, but that was a call. Like, like, I don't walk up on Rodney for a reason. Yeah, it's some niggas you just don't walk up on like that. Because you're going to fuck around and get your ass hit on accident. Like, it's, it's PTSD. They not, you can't walk up on a motherfucker like that while they sleep. That's how I am. Don't walk up on me while I'm, while I'm asleep. If I don't know you, I right, don't do that. Don't do that because I don't trust you at this point. Like, you're too close. Um, but if I do know you, oh, you could be standing right over me. <laughs> and I will not move. Like, Rodney literally has to shake me to wake me up. And that's the only, the best way to wake me up is be a human. Like, I, I don't know what happened today that I didn't hear anything. Like, normally I can hear my alarm and just sleep through it like I can hear the noise in my sleep and it just it just not wake up but I didn't hear shit y'all like nothing and I have an old school alarm clock radio come on and get over and my phone my phone got like five alarms on it the radio got two alarms on it it's it's a lot my phone be going off even if Christian calls sometimes, depending on how I sleep I am, because I will have her call and wake me up. She got to call like 20 times before I even wake up. And it's it's a good like it's a good thing and it's a bad thing because I don't want to be a soft sleeper where every little thing wake me up. But at the same time, sleeping that hard is dangerous. It's, it's fucking dangerous. Like, what if it's a fire or some shit and I'm sleeping that goddamn hard? And then... <clears throat> I be having shit to do and like I said I missed my COVID test so now I gotta reschedule for tomorrow and now I really gotta do the, the rapid rapid like at first I was gonna do the one to two day rapid now I gotta do the hours rapid and had to reschedule that appointment and then tomorrow I have a job interview at 1 30 what if this would have been tomorrow I would have been done bro that, that interview would have been done for <laughs> like I woke up at 2 it would have been a wrap so I'm like, nah, family, what you doing? I'd have been, nah, I can't do that. I can't do that. That's not happening. I and I don't know why I'm so tired. Like, I know I do a lot, but it's like my body is just dragging. Like, and I ain't take nothing. I mean, that I don't normally take. Like, I don't know what's causing me to be this drowsy, this tired, this sleepy. I have no earthly. And I hate it um, because I got things to do. I got to get ready for this trip. I'm on my way to Tudor. And then that's another thing because I'm so tired and sleepy. I can't, my brain won't even process all the shit that I got to do. It's like I know I got to do stuff and I just can't. My body ain't, I'm not all the way up yet. And I'm going to be all the way up at like 6 p.m. I swear at 6 p.m. I'm going to come back at 6 p.m. And I'm going to show y'all how wide up I am. Like, most of the videos y'all see me record be late at night. And y'all see how I am when I record late at night. Like, I'll be like, even the reaction videos and shit. Like, most of them hoes, I, it, it be like 2 in the morning. <laughs> and I'll be recording. Like, it's happening. So, yeah, I got to do better with that because that's what we not going to do. Come on, ride with me, ride with me, ride with me, ride with, I don't know why, where that, god damn it, son, <sighs> shit, um, made me lose my train of thought, but yeah, so we almost there, we got, we got two more days to go, two and a half-ish, tomorrow, I will go to my job interview, get my nails done, uh, I'm going to have to show y'all Choi. Let me see see if he going to let me record him. Put him on there real, real quick, real quick, because he's shy. <clears throat> but that's the guy that always do my nails. So, um, that and I got to go do the COVID test at 530 at CBS. And I got to make sure that everything, I got to get my good sis Natalie shirts out. If y'all have not purchased, please do. 
Um, I will put the the website information in the in the description. Get y'all love gang merch. All like we doing it. We doing it big. Go get get all that. Sis got like five five six t shirts you could you could choose from. So you can get one. You can get them all. You can get you can get whatever you want. Like I bought all of them because y'all got me messed up. Like I'm not finna rip love gang. On gang, gang, gang. Um, gotta give. Gotta make sure her shirts get out. And gotta show Christian some stuff. Little do she know she gonna be doing uh, some things while I'm gone. <laughs> I'm pretty sure she's not gonna be surprised, but I just ain't really just told her, told her. Um, I'm gonna miss like a really big event that the Harris count, uh, Harris uh, the lot. Fort Bend County Constable's Office Precinct 4 is doing a basketball tournament to raise money for TTM on December 4th. I'm sad I'm going to miss it, but that's the, the blessing of having a good team that can go and represent. So Christian going to go represent us in that thing. They're going to donate all the money to us and the Purple for Randy Survivors Fund. Because <coughs> we out here um, helping victims and survivors of domestic violence all day, every day. Um... What else coming? What do I have to do on Thursday? You know what? I don't have to do nothing on Thursday because I purposely did that so I could get ready for Jamaica. Like, I had to cut all of Thursday off. I know I'm going to have to end up doing something, but I just don't know exactly what it is. Um, that That's what I don't know. I just got to figure that out. Because something going to pop up, child. I ain't no telling Come on, I just want to get the Starbucks, bro. I ain't ate shit, and I hate going to there, and I ain't ate. My stomach be hurting. Like, my head gonna start hurting. I be dying. I'm gonna have to... See, and then from Starbucks, you can't just get a snack, because that shit be expensive. Like, if I get a banana nut bread, that motherfucker like $3. But I might have to take that in. Like, I need, like, a little something to put on my stomach. Um, I need multiple. And then, it, no. Well, I need espresso shots. But then it's like, damn, I don't know if I want them hoes because I ain't going to go to sleep. And I got to, I cannot miss this interview tomorrow. I swear. Y'all going to see me on here crying. If I pick up the camera at all, I'm going to cry. So, I can't do that. I can't do that. That's not happening. I gotta be on my P's and Q's, so yeah, you gotta take your bitch ass to sleep, homie. Um, but yeah, I ain't really got much cause my brain now, damn <laughs> girl, why your edges ain't done when I tell y'all I just got up and went, like I could at least brush them or something but I got this because I the hair be in my face and I don't like my hair in my face like that. Like it's probably gonna be pulled back or like up in like a half and half uh old school brandy look. Yeah, I'm gonna have to fix that. But I ain't going nowhere special right now, so it don't matter. Uh shout out to Sincere for getting me right with the twist, cause baby I was not finna go to Jamaica without no twist braids or something of some sort. Cause who <laughs> Who finna deal with that? <clears throat> so what else I got to do? I done bought all my stuff. I had to buy a whole new wardrobe. Like, I, I didn't even think about, like, I put the money to the side for actually going to Jamaica and paid for the trip. Did all that. Shout out to Sharice. She know why. Um, I didn't think about all the stuff that I had to buy. Like, because it's hot out there and out here it's winter time so I definitely had to get like swimsuits and shit but they ain't really just selling them hoes right now like they ain't selling summer clothes like that then you know you gotta get a certain caliber of clothes for, for Jamaica but guess what I get guess what I did get y'all already know cause y'all done seen the video the Tier collection <laughs> Baby, whole outfit's done. <clears throat> done. Only thing I needed to add was like a couple more, um, like an outfit for when we do the excursion. Cause I don't, it's gonna be probably a little dirty and and uh, adventurous. So I ain't wanna wear one of my good outfits. That is some some pajamas I threw in there that ain't really pajamas. More like t-shirts. 
t-shirts and shorts. Um, but other than that, baby, my outfit collection was sad. And I bought my little swimsuits. I'm packed. Like, I've been packing since last last week. I pack slowly every day because I'm not a last-minute packer. Well, not with something like this. I'm really not a last-minute packer. I, I don't want to do last-minute packing. Damn, I can't get on the motherfucking bed. Damn, I was supposed to go get my license place today. Bruh, come on, Miranda. God damn, man. man I, I need an assistant, bro. Like, I, I, man, I'm mad at myself. Like, I really be hard on myself because it's like, bro, you tripping. Get up, my nigga. You got shit to do. You can't be. And if I get a job, I damn sure gotta wake up on time. Like, that's all right. After Jamaica, it, I'm gonna get every. It's everything gonna be right. Everything gonna be together. So it's cool. I ain't tripping. Um, but that's where we at with that. I don't want to keep talking y'all ear off, but I low key need this content. So if y'all see me again. It's for show because um, I'm vlogging because I need all the content. I need. I had a topic I wanted to talk about too, and I completely forgot what it was. Damn. Should I get up? Yeah, yeah, I should. I don't trust you, motherfuckers. Y'all look like y'all. Fuck shit. Oh, yeah, I got to get my plates because I got to maybe get on the bellway. Oh, no. Baby, them plates going to have to get got. They going to have to get got like today. I was supposed to do that earlier. Um, the, the Lord gonna bless me with an assistant. It's, that's what's gonna happen. Cause I, I like Christian does a lot for me, but Christian can't do everything. Christian got a job, <laughs> and Christian got a family. Christian got people she take care of. Christian, she can't do everything for me. Like, and I like literally at this point don't even want to give her nothing else to do because it's like. I don't like I feel like I'm putting way too much on her. Like it's not it's not it's not her responsibility to do everything for me. And then especially cuz I can't properly pay her or compensate her right and I know it probably don't it's not a big deal to her cuz that's just the type of person she is, but with me I don't I don't like that. I don't like that. That's why people I always as I'm like, "Bro, I got to get rich cuz I owe Christian so much money. It don't make no sense." Like Sis, sis gonna get just about every goddamn. She gonna have a house, a car, no job. Like she, <laughs> she the beneficiary on all my paperwork anyway. Like, <laughs> like I owe sis so much money, it don't make no sense. But I need an assistant for real that can do shit. Like, oh, can you go get my license plates from the motherfucking uh, car dealership? Can you? write this email can you do this can you do that like oh i'm gonna be on vacation so i need this stuff to be done like that's a lot to put on her and she already got a job of the shit she gotta take care of because i she gonna burn herself out even though she don't see it i know she will because i've been there i know what it's like and i can't be the reason for that um but that's my dog man <laughs> Starbucks. I am almost to Pearland Kirby ish drive. Kirby drive. Girl, get your motherfucking life. Matter of fact, let me order my Starbucks right now. And I know y'all like, girl, why is you on the phone and driving? I know, I know. I'm about to come up on this light and I'm going to order it because I made that mistake yesterday when I didn't. I really 
really need to cook, but I'm not. I'm not cooking till I come back. I don't know what I'm gonna eat tonight, but I might have to come up with that. See, 10, 28. Oh my god. I ain't got no points. Come on, Starbucks. Y'all ain't got no. Espresso shop. Mm -mm. Why they charge you 70 cents for half and half? I'm so offended. I'm using 25 and a half cents. Because that brought it down a dollar. Whatever. You got to take them L's when your ass don't wake up on time and you got shit to do. happening <sighs> <clears throat> but yeah that's all i got for y'all on that on the update for that uh i'm trying to figure out how much more I, mm, it's gonna be a little mix of stuff like how like me recording like y'all might i might show y'all like my bags and shit i'm trying to decide exactly how i want to do the pre-trip planning vlog thing but not really sure so, and the only thing is, I don't like stopping the vlog while I'm still driving. So, I probably will just get quiet and fix it later. So, <coughs> thank y'all for riding with me, even though I'm sorry my energy level is extremely low. Um, I gotta go back and watch that video because I might have to redo it. And then it get dark early now, so I can't vlog in the car after fucking six o'clock but uh appreciate y'all for riding with me talking to me chatting with me um i need all the energy before i get to jamaica because i'm probably gonna sleep that first day <laughs> i'm gonna be so tired that's why i was like damn i need to i should have took a vacation beforehand like i should have took a vacation before i went to jamaica that way I can get all my tiredness and sleepiness and somehow like go to a hotel and just sleep or something. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Uh -huh. Look at that. Look at that. Yep. That, that be the issue right there. So I will talk to y'all later and uh, it's going down in a couple days. So I will let y'all know. I will keep y'all posted. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Vlogmas is happening. He got on his flasher, so let me get the fuck out of the way. Baby, did you just slam on your... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, nah. It's time for me to get to where I'm going, because I don't know why. For the life of you, did you just feel like you had to slam on your brakes? It wasn't no stop sign. We are on the feeder road.